Hi everyone, I'm Carmen and I'm the designer behind New Leaf Designs and I'm very excited to bring you this course, Color Work Confidence Masterclass. And if you know me, you know that I'm a big fan of color work knitting. I love that it keeps you entertained while you're knitting. You see the pattern emerging bit by bit after you work round after round and you'll want to keep knitting until it's finished. Your projects will look even more amazing and they will look so complicated and impressive to non-knitters while it's an anti knitters as well. <laughs> uh, well, it's actually not very difficult to knit. And this is a big bonus for me. It's warmer as well. Since you're knitting with more than one color, the color that you're not using is carried on the back, which gives you an extra layer of warmth, which is perfect for socks, sweaters, scarves, hats. The fabric also holds its shape very well since it's less stretchy than regular knitting, which is great for cushion covers, bags, you name it. In this masterclass, I'm using Scapis Metropolis yarns, which is a blend of 75% merino and 25% nylon. This is a great yarn for color work knitting as it has at least 70% of animal fiber. Color work won't work as well with plant fiber such as bamboo or cotton as it is a little bit too slippery. It's even better if you have 100% wool, but 75% wool or merino will do very nicely as well. So in this masterclass, I'm going to teach you how to knit color work right from the beginning. You just need to know how to knit, but uh, you don't need to have any color work experience. I will teach you how to hold your yarns. I have three ways for that, so you're bound to find a way that suits you. I will teach you how to wrap floats. Floats are the little bits of unused yarn at the back. And if you have a long piece of one color, then you want to wrap the float in the back. Otherwise, it's just a large loop hanging there and you might catch it with your fingers or something. I will teach you how to knit corrugated rib, which is a super fun technique, one of my favorites. I have a special trick for weaving in ends. I will show you how to fix mistakes in color work because believe me, we've all been there. <laughs> we all make mistakes and in color work, you just don't want to rip back. So I'm going to teach you how to fix a mistake without ripping back. Um, and then lastly, I'm going to show you how to knit a three color color work, which is a little bit tricky, even for me, as you will see in the video, but it's a very fun technique if you get the hang of it and you can make amazing things. I hope to be welcoming you soon into my Color Work Confidence Masterclass course. And be sure to also check my website, newleafdesigns.nl for lots of crafty content, lots of patterns, also free ones. And I hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.